Hello everyone, it's Shai Schwartzman here with the Done For You online marketing system and I'm happy to be joined today by George Lorimer from San Diego, uh, one of our uh, top platinum agents in the program and today I've asked George to join us because he's doing some really cool things uh, with the converter. He's really implemented the ultimate converter, seller, buyer, uh, converters into his business. And I wanted to take the next few minutes uh, and have George walk us through and give us some ideas, strategies, best practices that he implements in his business and how he uses the ultimate converters effectively. So, George, I appreciate you joining us today. Thank you very much for your time. Yeah, thanks for having me. When you were presented with the Ultimate Converters, what what about it appealed to you? What what need did you feel that it would fill? Yeah, so when I get the inquiries and my team goes on appointments, I wanted to have a standard that we pre-sold them so it's easier for them to go out and get higher um, commission listings. And then also for me, I wanted to have less competition when they saw everything that we did articulated you know, very easily when we went in would save us time and also we'd get less resistance on fee, so get a higher fee because uh, we do more and get better results for people. And what about the converter th you, do you feel allows that to happen? Well, I, I think it, you know, gets all the platinum concepts that are there and it like, it drills down on them and if you use the platinum, you know, the ultimate converter and then the platinum listing presentation, you'll touch on the exact same point numerous times and it will drill it home and it'll keep you on the right message of what we know that sellers want on listing their home and what agent. So it, it keeps you on track and uh, and it really reinforces you know the other marketing we do, um, the bomb, and then also our platinum listing presentation. George, in what instances, in what situations would you be using the ultimate converter? Okay, so you know probably the number one is I get a listing appointment where I get something a little bit stronger than a CMA. So somebody wants to know the market value of their home, and I know I'm going over there. And I want to pre-sell them prior to me getting over there. And if I don't have, well, I send it either way, but it's especially good if I'm meeting with them, say, the next day, and I wouldn't have time to print stuff out and deliver a pre-listing package. It would be a, a great pre-listing package that we send out. And then we typically, we both email it and we also text it to them. What do you find works better? Do you have any... Uh opinion on what you think works better? Is it just better to send both? Yeah, I think so. And the other thing too, Shai, is you got to make sure, you know, sometimes when we send it from the system, it goes into the spam. So we email it to ourselves and then we make any adjustments on the email and then we forward it from our email account. Do you let them know to expect it? And what sort of language do you use to yeah. let them know? Right, so so when I when I set the appointment with them, I said, great. So I'll be sending you out a personalized online home selling kit. You know, take a couple minutes and look at it. Uh, I'll send it out within five minutes, and this will save you a lot of time, and it'll show you what we do to get homes sold. And you might have certain questions after taking a look at it, and we'll be happy to address those, those tomorrow when we meet. And so then I'll send it to them, and I'll send them an email and then I'll cut and paste the link within the email into my phone to text them as well. And I'll say, hey, here's the you know, personalized online home selling kit that I said I'd sent you. you know, just click on it and take a look at it. And how, what percentage of people would you say look at it? Uh, if, Most. Yeah. Like probably, yeah, over like 75%. George, tell us what results you see uh, your or your agents who go out and meet these folks after they've uh, reviewed or accessed the converters? 
Yeah, it gives it a whole different conversation on, you know, it's not as a matter of if they will be choosing us. It's In some cases, it gives people an idea if they can afford us or, hey, we're definitely the agent they're going to choose if we want the listing. George, is there any other instances where you would use the ultimate converter? Yeah, we'd, we'd use it with buyers too. And the main reason is if they're getting a bunch of information from other agents, we want to have them not pick us on what we're sending them. We want to have them pick us based on the services we give them, priority access to hot new listings, giving them properties that they can't find on their own, and also um, satisfied customers and testimonials, which you know, the ultimate converter, the buyer one, is full of that as well. How important, I, I, I believe it's important, but how important is it to fill up some of these spaces that you've done so uh, so well with testimonials? Oh, it's critical and it's it's really easy. You just, yeah, it's critical because, you know, they can see us saying how great we are, but we really have to have some customers, you know, telling a real story and not too scripted, but giving powerful testimonials of, you know, how they were skeptical and we did a great job and we were there for them the whole time and, you know, we made the transaction smooth, we helped them get it for a great price, things like that. We, we really have to show that um, there's real people out there that have given, given us high recommendations. Since you've started using the Ultimate Converter, can you, can you share results uh, that, that you can attribute uh, to pre-selling uh, sellers and buyers with the ultimate converter. Yeah, it's funny because I've been uh, I've had buyers agents for quite a while and it's increasing their conversion and people showing up to the appointments and also them signing VIP buyer agreements and on the seller side I've been recently uh, had a an agent that works with me who's gone out as a listing agent for me and this is the funny part is by having these standards set up and pre-selling it, he's able to walk in and get the listing signed, so it's not so critical that I'm there. He's articulating the same message. So I think it's standardized and given me, you know, more come list me type of calls or come list me type of appointments at full fees. What are some best practices uh, that you can share? Uh, I know that uh, we, and you're getting great open rates, and and the results uh, uh, you've articulated the results of those open rates. What are some best practices that you can share with our listeners and viewers that to get people to open it to? Um, because once they open it, I think they they can really see the point of difference uh, that the, that the members uh, make. Uh, uh, either on the listing side or the buyer side, but it's to get them to open it and, and members tell us, oh, it's hard to get them to open it or they don't open it or it doesn't work. What are some best practices that you've implemented uh, through your experience that you could share? Well, so the first thing is they have to receive it. And so I think if you send it from the system, so when you input it, if you put their email directly, uh, it very often goes to spam. So you don't want to do that. You want to put your email, but you put their name in so the URL is their name. And then what happens a lot of times is, you know, I forget to change like the appointment time or something when I do the, uh, when I send it out. So I'm, I like to have it in my email sent to me with their URL link. And then I'm proof it one more time and then I just forward it from my email. And so then it's just a direct email from me. And sometimes to help them open it, I might say, you know, here's some info on pricing your home too. That way they'll think it's comps for their home, they'll click on it, and they'll probably be more interested than thinking it's a sales pitch from us. I think it's important to really give them the benefits of viewing it. Uh, it's so they don't think that it's some um, marketing material, but right. that it is uh, it's going to help them sell their home faster for more money. These are these are uh, this is this is information on 
certainly how we sell homes faster and for more money, and plus our guarantee, but it also gives them information that they can use uh, whatever they decide to do. It's just good information on selling your home or, or buying a home. Right. Yeah, absolutely. I agree. So so that's one of them, Shai, and then the other one that I think is important is, you know, a lot of times even forwarding from us can go to spam or they don't check it. You know, it's not their priority. So then we send us a copy of it, you know, to our phone email, and then we'll cut and paste the link of their URL, and then we'll text it to them and say, hey, you know, make sure and check this out. You know, it just takes a minute to look at and it's your you know, personalized online home selling kit. You know, I'll see you tomorrow at 5. And then, and then just following up with them to make sure that they received it. A lot of times people um, don't respond. And so we just say, hey, I don't know if you got that. We sent you out some information on your home that's really important. That will help you know, on the meeting and on pricing your home to sell. Did you happen to take a look at it? It only takes a couple minutes. And we just ask, so we make sure it's delivered to them, and then we ask so that they'll respond back. Oh, yeah, I got it. Thanks. I checked it out. Here's one thing, Shai, too, is maybe tying the, the appointment confirmation with them reviewing that. So saying something like, hey, I just want to make sure we're meeting you know, tomorrow at 10 and that you've also taken a look at this. You know, I want to make sure that we sent you out the stuff so that you'll have all the information prior to this meeting. So just let me know. Thanks. Yeah, I think it's really, I think it's really important. Like the fact that you mentioned that you're sending it via email, you're sending it via text message, so that you're. Some people, uh, some people, you know, prefer to look at it in different ways. So that's, I think that's that's great, and letting them know the benefits of looking through it. Um, right. And I think, and the other point you've made that you made earlier is letting them know how it's coming. So I'm sending it to you via text message. I'm sending it to you via email. Uh, you're sending it from your email address so that, oh, it's from George Lorimer's team or to George's office. I was supposed to get this. So they don't think it's spam. They don't think it's some malicious email. Right. So they know to expect it and what, and really what to expect and that there's a benefit for them to to review it. Right. And it'll save them time is probably the big benefit, Shai. Hey, when we meet, this will this outlines what we'll be talking about and you can have certain questions based on this and also we'll save you some time because it goes through an in depth marketing of what we do to get home sold for the C type of personality. Right. And when you let them know that it's coming or how it's coming, do you direct them Specifically to any spots, uh, you should take a look at this or take a look at that, or do you just let you do you let it speak for itself? I never thought of that, but that's a good idea. Yeah, I just just wondering if you actually direct them. Oh, take a look at the step one video. Uh, make sure to look at the material in the step two binder. Just just a thought. I don't know. I don't know if if anyone is doing that, but it, it may be something that people who are listening wanna wanna try. Mm -hmm. Any final thoughts or recommendations, uh, uh, George, uh, about uh, the converter? Yeah, I think you know, giving it a shot and doing it, I think it will increase your conversion rates and getting higher commissions and having less competition. And I think that helps quite a bit. And then also just doing the information, the exercise of it, will tighten up your presentation and increase the reasons of why people should choose you versus the competition. And so when I did this and I started asking for testimonials, I mean it just makes you a better business person and it summarizes it in, you know, this simple step that you can give out to people that's just like laser focused. I mean anybody could take testimonials of themselves and put it on Put it on uh, YouTube, but the thing is to have so many of the different resources that are super tight, that are just laser focused on the Platinum program and the USPs and everything that they found out why people choose us and what they want in agents. I don't think you can get something like this that will work on phones, that will work on computers, on Macs, on Windows. It's just, I mean, it's a great system. It's an amazing resource. 
Well, thank you very much, George. I really appreciate the opportunity to speak to you, and thank you very much for sharing your experience and your best practices today with our members uh, on, on, on the Ultimate Converters. And uh, thank you very much for your time today. All right. Thank you, Shai.